On a night where um, the shots aren't falling from deep, how nice is it to have an Otto Porter Jr. go four for six from deep like that? Yeah, it was important. We needed somebody to uh, to start knocking down shots, and and uh, Otto made some timely ones, especially in that in that second half. Uh, and it, it was uh, he was due. You know, he's he's such a great shooter and hadn't shot it well the last couple of games, so you kind of sense that it was coming. Uh, but the beauty of our team is we've got uh, we've got a lot of guys who shoot the ball well. So um, you know, usually uh, over the course of the game, we're gonna we're gonna find a couple of guys who are gonna knock down shots, and uh, and 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 we'll we'll ride with that. Otto, you you have a number of players on your team, yourself included, that, that can kind of flip a game by by getting hot. You know, Coach Kurt said you would maybe struggled a little bit lately, but but tonight was your night. I mean, do you get that sense that there, there's a group where if one or two of you are making shots on a given night, that can that can flip a game where maybe you guys don't have a lot going on otherwise? Yeah, yeah, we got a lot of guys that can you know get high at any moment of the game. Um, on any given night. So uh, whoever's got it going, we'll try to get them good looks. Um, but as a team, you know, we try to rely on our defense to get us good looks, you know. Um, you know, we get stops, we get rebounds, we can push out and get easy looks, get to the rim, get fouled. Um, like I said, every every night, every game is, is different. And anybody, anybody can, you know, step up and knock down shots. How do you physically feel compared to what's like first week first couple weeks of the season uh, i'm still getting my legs um continue to, to work with the trainers uh with the doctors uh, making sure that you know legs are fresh um continue to do our prevention work after the games uh just continue to stay on top of it you know don't want it to slip up do you historically do you start to feel better as the season goes on? Uh, I mean, how how you know it's such a marathon season. How does your body usually respond? Uh, I mean, yeah, it's still early. Um, normally, warm up halfway through. You know, mid season form. That's what everybody call it. Um, still right around the corner. You still got a lot of games to play. Um, just gonna try to take it one game at a time. Yeah, Bielita found some nice open shots for you as the game went on, especially in that third quarter. How has your guys' chemistry kind of grown as the season has gone on off the bench? Uh, it's, every game is, is getting better and better. He's a smart player. Um, you know, he takes what the defense can give him. Um, I mean, those plays, the defense was just – he was able to get to the paint, and the, the defense just collapsed, and he was able to find the open guy. A couple of times it was me. A couple of times it was D. Lee. Uh, wigs on the backside, so uh, we just preach that we just get the you know ball to the open man. I don't, uh, kind of following up Anthony there. I I see you pregame with the resistance bands and doing quite a uh, you know quite an extensive routine. Is that is that the way it has to go for you to just get those legs ready night after night? And uh, absolutely. I mean, it just, you know, activates my core, uh, gets me game ready. I mean, uh, making sure that, you know, I'm using my core more than anything. Well, you guys are winning at a pretty crazy pace so far. How's it feel? What's it feel like for you? I mean, you've been in situations where you won some games, but not like this. No, I'm just alone for the ride, just like you are. I mean, it's amazing. But like I said, we we know what we're capable of, and it's just a matter of us coming out and doing it every night, you know, uh, taking one game at a time. Um, and when we're out there, we got to focus on Warriors basketball. Jordan, uh, Otto Porter's had a knack maybe on some nights where you guys as a team haven't shot well, but but he'll hit three or four and, and kind of help you guys flip the game. Have you noticed that about him and just what he's brought to the table overall? Yeah, um, I think what's really good about our team is we have so many uh, shooters and people who can space the floor. Uh, being able to have Otto come in and um, be as consistent of a shooter as he is uh, is huge and helpful for our team. But we also have Dealey and Belly and Wiggs and Steph um, and Clay's coming back. So we have a lot of shooters. It's going to be a very – uh, very rare that everybody's off, you know, and I think that's something that's really good for our team and we just got to find ways to work around it.